This afternoon we're going to experiment further with um, trying to get a punchy uh, Moog style bass or, or synth sound. Uh, I have another video, but this time I'm going to do it slightly differently uh, using LFOs rather than envelopes. And I'm also going to use an envelope for the FM. So let's start. I'm starting with a nip patch, which is a just a standard 8 foot sawtooth. Now I'm going to set up a filter first and then we'll worry about the rest later. I'm going to set the cutoff to zero. I'm going to set the resonance to 42. Set key track to 100 percent. Right now I should not be really getting anything. That's good. I'm going to set up an LFO, and this is a funky LFO because I'm using LFO as an envelope. I'm going to set my LFO 1 to square wave, speed of 0, start phase of 0. Now, I'm going to fade that all the way out to minus 64. And according, I've already scoped this information. Now, when I set the delay to 5, it's going to give me about a 30 millisecond sustain portion, just sustain. If I set it to 4, it's going to give me about a 20 millisecond. So we're starting with a 20 millisecond. Now, I have to assign that to the filter. So on filter 1, I'm going to apply my mod source to LFO1, which is fine. I set the mod amount to about 58. I set delay to 5, it will be about 30 millisecond of straight. Now I can turn this into envelope by adjusting the fade. I set the fade to say about minus 48. I'm getting clicking there, that's because I haven't set my release on my amplitude envelope. Now, that's pure linear, so what I'm going to do is write a modifier. I'm going to say LFO1 is multiplied by LFO1, and then assign that to filter 1 mod source. Now I'm adjusting my envelope with the LFO. I don't touch the delay, but I touch the fade. Now it's going to have an exponential rather than linear release. Okay, let's get funkier. So I'm now going to set my FM to filter envelope 1, which hasn't been used anywhere. I'm going to my filter envelope and set it to one shot. Set attack level to zero. Attack and decay to zero for now. Set sustain one to zero and release to about 64. I have to make sure that my sustain one is set. Now, I'm going to set this like this. Hear that? So 
so I'm actually delaying the filter envelope by the amount of delay because the stain is set to one and not zero and attack level set to zero it actually sits there as a delay let's increase the amount Steaks are always free. Anyhow, that's just an experiment. Enjoy.